Hey yo guys, it's your man Sustic, and today we're gonna play Rage 2. I'm really new to this series, never played or seen a first game. All I know from the trailer is it's a combat game with vehicles and mechs. Style kinda reminds me Mad Max. So I thought we can play something different. So our last gameplay walkthrough was about Devil May Cry 5. If you didn't check it out, you can click right upper corner. It's a really good game. But anyway, now we're playing Rage 2. Brand new, fresh, post-apocalyptic world. Let's do this. Came tumbling down, all premature, pouring life back into the barren lands, starting the cycle of life anew, as we had planned to do with our own species. Our plans were thwarted by the naive and arrogant masses. The cleansing of our weakened species was hindered. Our aid selfishly refused. They chose their own pitiful existence over the future of the breed. Such hubris. They thought us defeated. We let them believe us defeated. But we moved underground. We watched their petty squabbles, their meaningless turf wars, their childish attempts at order from chaos, and we grew strong. Our science, our expertise, all aligned, all with one sole purpose, the surgical culling of the weak. Man reborn! We tear down the defenses. We take their compounds. We take the arcs. We raise their settlements and townships to the ground. Tonight marks the beginning of the cleansing. Tonight marks the rebirth of the authority. Okay. What the hell is going on out there? Nothing good. Better gear up and move out. It's go time, right? Yeah, grab your gear. What is that? So we have pistol. And oh, butterfly knife. I'll secure the door. Oh. oh, come on, Lily. That was my kill. <laughs> you gotta move a little faster, Walker. Lily, the closest thing I ever had to family. We grew up here in Vineland, raised by her drill sergeant of a mother. Me, I'm an orphan. I don't have a mother. But there's plenty more where that came from. I'm telling you, this is the big one. All right. Well, let's go fucking get some. Come on. Let's do this. Okay, already feels like uh, Apex Legends. dead we just started uh something something i don't want to read actually 
KT. Jersey. Yep, not family friendly, guys. It's all up to me now. Take it. This is not going to be a family friendly video. Shit, mom's gonna skin you alive messing with Ranger gear. Uh, but it's still got a lot of Jersey in it. Yeah, but it's our only shot. Oh, yeah. This is even better than I thought. Lily, I need you in the garage. Walker. Switch weapon. Roger that. On my way. G. Jealous, Lily? Damn right I am. I would have been the youngest ranger to ever get sworn in if not for this bullshit nano trike crap. Combat this bastard. Nope. I'm playing Doom right now. Slaying demons. Overdrive. Oh, we have overdrive. Let's do this. I 
I don't know where I'm going right now. Okay. Dear old Aunt Prowley, decorated war hero, ranger, and role model. Especially for Lily. She took me in when my parents died. <laughs> the meanest mom this orphan wildcard never asked for. Reporting for duty! Come here! That's Jersey's armor. Jersey, they killed him. If you're brave enough to put on his armor, you're brave enough to do his job. What the fuck is that? Never seen anything so big. Makes an easy target. Can't be. He should be dead. General Cross. Aim at the head. everything else general cross the evil leader of the evil authority our own boogeyman a bedtime story for naughty kids like me i don't know if prowley has lost it or if it's really true do you know this though if it is i'm not gonna stand for it Son of a stand down that's a direct order <laughs> oh uh -oh. Where are you taking me, big monster? Nice. Uh oh. There we go. And we're knocked out. Let me guess, they're gonna execute her. Erwina Prowley, is that you? I was set to spare the lives of you original archists for experimentation. But for you, I'll make an exception for old times, Erwina. <laughs> After all, your uselessness is what once spared my life. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we can jumpstart this. Clear. Wait, wait, the fuck! Fuck's sake! Oh, I was conscious. Yeah, you were. But your shiny new armor needed a jolt. So this is it then. This is all that's left. Just over 20 survivors. We're still digging out the ruins. I saw Prowley. It was General Cross. He... He killed her. He killed my mother. I don't know how. But we gotta stop him. And I'll personally wring the neck of that goddamn wrinkled bastard. I never really believed the stories. That the authority would return. Well, they did. And we gotta do something about it. Mom knew what to do. The rangers knew. Wait a minute. They kept their files, the logs. They kept them in the Presidio. The ranger CP. You nuts. Only rangers can go in there. Look at me, Lily. <laughs> I'm the only ranger left. Holy shit. You really are. This guy sounds like Nicolas Cage, not gonna lie. something for me in here, Prowley. Unknown intruder. This is Presidio Security Protocol. State your name, rank, and business. Wall 
rat unit, Corporal Walker. I'm here to find information about... Uh, about my... Uh, about Ranger Unit Sergeant Erwina Prowley. Processing. Security protocol override. <laughs> This rotten banana. Really cool like details. Nice. We have a skill tree, looks like, upgrading our skill. Okay, weapons. Look at that. Dart launcher. It's massive. Ooh, hyper cannon. Oh, charge pulse cannon. Definitely want to try them. Make me super soldier, Welcome giant ball. Let's do this. Here we so go. I just stick my hand into this strange hole and hope for the best. Huh. There goes nothing. Welcome to the simulation chamber. In here, you will be able to gain proficiency in the use of your art weapons and any ID accessions. You have successfully installed ID accession dash. With the dash accession, you will be able to evade incoming threats and become harder to hit. Remain between. 
between me and the other three original daggers. First, John Marshall of Gun Barrel, a tough, no-nonsense old war horse who led the first fight against the Authority. He understands the importance of technology and spycraft better than anyone. His skills will help keep you off the Authority's radar. Second, Luce of Hagar of Wellspring, daughter of war hero Dan Hagar. She went from guerrilla fighter to mayor of the greatest city in the wasteland. Her access to military-grade vehicles will be indispensable. And then, there's Dr. Anton Kvasir, ex-authority scientist turned resistance fighter. He's a genius when it comes to nanotrite technology and mutations. His skills are a cornerstone of the Dagger Project. You will want to know more down the road. Your Ranger Armor CPU has logs that will be able to answer many of your questions. Good luck out there. Okay, guys, so I'll see you in next episode. Peace out.